am Brayden Flynn, your host of The Artist Report. Uh, recently had the opportunity to be a part of Photo Field Trip, where I spoke a bit, moderated some panel discussions, and got to participate as well. Uh, but if you didn't hear of it, Yeah Field Trip is a community of creatives. I think there was about 400 of us there getting together over a couple days to learn, to shoot, and be inspired. Um, but if you didn't, and if you didn't make it this last year, you've got to go next year. It was just awesome, awesome time. Um, but between lectures or on walks to various photo excursions, I had some brief conversations with fellow attendees and recorded them to share with you. So watch on and enjoy. So, just want to introduce yourself real quick. Yeah, my name is Paul Octavius, and I'm a photographer from Chicago. Excellent. And uh, what would you say your specialty with photography is? Uh, I shoot commercial and editorial and fine art and Instagram. <laughs> so that's, a, that's, a, that's a thing. So, yeah. It is a thing. And, and you are a part of Tinker Street? I'm a part of Tinker Street and Tinker Street Mobile. Yeah. So um, what Tinker Street is, it's an agency out in New York. And um, they recently started a mobile division of Tinker Street, Tinker Street Mobile. And it's like the best uh, mobile photographers uh, in the world. Amazing. And cool to be part of that. Really cool. Really cool. It's an honor. And um, can I just ask what, I guess, because there's such a now element with Instagram and just photography that's become so just accessible and easy for someone to just pick up and do, what, I guess, what makes something art or what makes something just like, or maybe either art or like a unique photograph? Um, you know what's interesting? Uh, I was talking about it with a friend the other day. People are thinking more about the image you're about to make than just taking a photograph which is really awesome like my mom is like thinking of the photograph to take not just taking it you know what i mean she's thinking of the angle just because you know everyone sees now how far mobile photography can be pushed and how far they can be pushed and that people are saying oh i am a photographer now you know and i think anyone can be a photographer which is a great part you know everyone has these tools these tools are becoming so cheap now that technology is advancing, that anyone could do it. So, um, yeah, it's just uh, it's just a really cool thing, like that people are actually conceptualizing and thinking about the photo they're about to take. So it's a really great thing. Yeah. And with with Instagram, do you feel like it is, uh, and, and with the way that like streams and like you're you have you're sort of forced to choose a photo and post what you think is the best. How how has that sort of changed the way that you photograph, or has it? Well, you know, for me, it's more so I can. Um, it's in real time, you know, because before I could take a photograph, uh, I would have to bring it home, upload it to the in upload to my computer into Lightroom, edit it, upload to the internet, and then maybe show people a couple of people, hey, this is my photo. But now I can just use my iPhone, upload to Instagram, and a half a million people see it, which is like an honor, and you don't take that for granted. So it's just it's pretty amazing how fast you can get something out, news or anything out to people now. So it's great. It's really great. Awesome. We we'll love what you do, and uh, thanks for your input.